Okay, I am back. Thank you for sticking around. See, it's nighttime again. <clears throat> All right, um, what do we have in here? We have the green. I have a bit bag and a stone chisel. Don't need anything more than a stone chisel in this pack because the chisels don't take durability. Um, they do normally. This pack has that disabled. Let's see. I'm trying to think. I need some glass, which means we need to collect some sand. And I need to figure out... I don't want the French doors to be white. Because otherwise it's just a white building with white doors and you won't be able to see. So I'm trying to decide if this is going to be an a, opportunity to use birch, or if maybe they'd be really cool if I did dark oak, maybe spruce. I'll have to look. Um, do I have dark oak? I need to grow some dark oak. I know I have spruce. Um, I need to take this. Is just. Out of control. Out of control. I don't even have the storage space for all this. What am I doing? Okay, was I able to pick it all up? Wow. I didn't think I had the inventory space for all of that. I still have space. Okay. Um, dark oak tree. Put you right there. And we'll wait for you to grow. Let's go put the food away. And I'm just thinking dark oak might work really well. Let's see if any of this is in there. I don't think I can just. That is one thing. I mean, this is a very manual process for um, food cooking, but I absolutely love that you don't have to keep looking up recipes. You in here for now. Okay. Back out here. Let's grab some spruce. And we need to get glass. I, that might be something. Set up a cobble works. <laughs> that might be something nice to do. Let me, I should jot that down. I'm gonna do that real quick. Because it's not the first time I've gone, I really need a cobble works. Oh, yeah, there we go. So, let's get some creative juices flowing, shall we? At 10.30 in the morning on a Saturday. <laughs> I first want to see if spruce would look good. I think I had some dark oak stairs in here I can use just for color reference. Now we're envisioning the door frames, the door frames here, with the glass on the inside. Hmm. Now I can chisel these two, the dip, well, not that one, but I can chisel these to a different texture. But right now we're just doing color. And I have vetoed spruce. It's too light, I think. Mm. This one looks richer. And I'm thinking this looks too much like the granite patio. 
think we're doing dark oak. All right. So that means we need to get those tr that tree growing so we can collect some. Um, oh, you know what? I might have some down here because I needed the dark oak for the builder's hut or for this over here, one of the two. So I actually had to go looking for it when I missed with building. I might have some in here. I do not. <laughs> Hopeful thinking failed. <laughs> yeah, we'll have to grow this tree. This is where twerking mod would be nice. But um, I have bone meal, so that works too. Bones. And we'll get some of that. Make sure that there's nothing around the, the saplings. Yay, first try. Now here's the hope. Will we get four saplings in return? Or will we be in deficit for saplings? we might be even lucky. Ooh, ooh. I wonder if that's been turned up. Twelve saplings? Oh, okay, that's... That has to have been turned up. Alright, doing there. Okay. That. We need to go sand collecting or make a cobble works um because we turn this into we can turn this into gravel and the gravel becomes sand we need at least more power um, eventually, we could just make one sag mill, but I haven't even unlocked any of the Ender.io stuff in the quest book. Right here. And it was likely I need to do some more industrial age pressing to do that. Specifically steel. We should probably make a blast furnace. I've been doing the cheaty cheaty method and make using it in the tinker smeltery, which isn't supposed to be available. But I've been doing it anyway. <laughs> For this one right here, we need to make we need to do this. Um, do I even have blaze powder? That might have been the hang up. I don't think I've I don't have enough. Side tracking, side tracking. Let's just go collect a bunch of sand. Um, it's around water. Let's go this way. <laughs> Let's do the sand. Ooh, we got a decent amount of sand right here. Let's go. Uh, do I have a shovel? Because I don't believe the mattock works really well with sand. It's going to be nighttime, but we have a sleeping bag now. A pretty dis decent landmass here. It has pretty much every biome I could really want. Uh, 
but I am quite a ways from spawn. I'm quite a ways from the other simpletons, so when I can get the fast travel set up, that will be nice. <laughs> Might want to work on learning how to use the V's craft, um, oh, the ships, airships. That would probably make traveling and checking out other simpleton spaces and hanging out with them a little easier. Alright, so we have a bunch of sand. It's not exactly a flat surface, but it is sand. So, go to town. Collecting some sand. Let's get four stacks. We'll collect four stacks of sand, you know, the old vanilla method. And then we'll head home. Plenty of sand to get started on those French doors. Um, figuring out what we want to do for that. This won't take very long at all. We're already at two stacks. being molested by mobs, that's a surprise. I'm pretty sure I'm still alone. Yeah. Three stacks. <laughs> you don't have to if you don't want to. <laughs> I was just confused because when no one else is on, usually I have a ton of mobs bugging me. Okay, we're good. <laughs> and with no one on to distribute the uh, mob cap. <laughs> you need to farm materials. What are you working on in the pack, Silver Fox? Where are you? What What are you progressing with? Your village. Ah, and this is a mine colonies village, right? Are <laughs> you need to do the Batania setup? <laughs> I'm certainly that. I'm certain that is something we can discuss. <laughs> I have all the patience for Batania. All right, let's put sand here. Put some sand in here. Do some waiting. Well, instead of that, we're gonna start doing the frames. I think. Do I have a? I do have one pattern. Get the chisel and the bits out and the regular chisel. Okay. I haven't looked at my reference image, 
today. The bees will just not happen unless I decide it's time. To there aren't any bees. Oh, you mean just in comparison to the same as for mods as Batania? Gotcha. Alright, so if we're going to do Dark Oak, which I would think I would like to do, let's see if there is a different pattern. For now, we're thinking the lower part of the French door that's going to be solid wood. I actually might enjoy doing the crisscross shape. Um, oh, I won't be doing bees in this pack. There aren't any. But in The Simple Life 3? The Simple Life 3 is where I'm going to do some bees. Yeah, there aren't any bees in this pack. That fancy crate might be a good idea. Let's make one. Of the fancy crate. Now we're visioning the bottom part of the door. This this part here, this two two, two by two spot, will be frame with glass on the inside. There'll be some alabaster going across here with another framed in glass piece. Which I should grab some alabaster. So that is the plan. I think I like this as the kick part of the door. Um, what other options do we have? Another one in there and let's do... Let's look at the scaffold. Oh, but I... I, 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 I okay, one. I like that both of these blocks have a exterior rim because that'll work really well to do the similar thing to this that's got the depth. Hmm. Bees are relatively grindy. Yep. And you're not going to be able to kill the grindy stuff because um, 99 blocks is not going to put Gendistry or Binnies in it. Which, Binnies makes it even more grindy, so you don't really want Binnies. Binnies genetics is extremely grindy. Um, but yeah. Once it's set up, though, and you can automate it, which that's something I'm not sure if we'll be able to, if there's um, pipes that he's going to be adding that will work. Um, we'll see. Cross our fingers on that. Um... It's a set it and forget it process once you've got the bees you need. It's just the getting the bees. All right, I need you guys' opinions. Those of you who want to participate, tell me which one do you like? Do you like one or two? One or two? We have two votes for two. I think we might do two. I think it'll work really well for the bottom of the door. Alright. Pick you up. And what we're gonna do is... Turn you into bits. And then the bits I want set to plane. <laughs> um and do I I want them Let's see. That replaced. Oh. Hello. Hi, Solid Damage Run. 
Now, what I'm thinking is the bottom part will be three pixels wide and the middle section of this one will be where the glass is. So if we do that, is that where I want the door? Okay. Um, that looks pretty good. The next thing I need to figure out though is in order to do two blocks for the next section, I want to use a block that um, won't look broken. Let me try to figure out what I mean here. This on place. That works for one pixel wide. I think I want two. There's my problem. I want a two pixel wide frame, I believe, and here it's broken because that's the way this block is. If I can use one that has more of a connected texture or if I just use the regular planks. I actually might like the fancy. Ooh, the blinds. Well, the blinds are gonna look funny going because they're horizontal. There's some vertical. Let's see here. If we wake you up, and these are the ones I want to look at. Let's can I undo that? And I need to do up again. That has a decent connected texture. It's the same color. And we want to go this way as well. That's interesting. Since these are horizontal, might be changing that up. Might be changing that up. So. Door frame. Yeah, I might be using one that has a horizontal look to it for that. Um, this is the one I want to do this. Was it really dark? I didn't even notice. Alright, now in the middle here... Uh, there's this side. And there's this side. That's interesting. You <laughs> almost beat double O's level of sleep skill. Cute! That line right there is because I'm using the type of block I'm using. Um, hmm. Does not work out the same on for this, that there. Oh boy. Um, I'm not sure I like that. What other, what 
can we do here? We're looking for something that is relatively similar all the way around then. I uh, could do the panel, but it would have that line because it's got a square. Uneven vertical braid. The blinds would probably work for the horizontal. So it would be this bit here. And that would probably work fine for that. But we still need to figure out the right hand side. It doesn't quite look right with the... Hmm. What does this look like at the top and bottom of those spots? Ooh, that might do it. You see these two pixels? That's what I'm looking for. And the other side, they're reverse. They're... Let's see what this one looks like. Um, you up. And it... This one. Alright, so I should be able to... Take you out. I'll put you in. Oh, dang it! Hmm, that's... I didn't even notice that. That's not even the right color. Did I do spruce? I did spruce, guys. I didn't do the right book. <laughs> let's let's get that going. Um, I won't need that at all. So let's put that in our bag. We need to do that chisel bit with the dark oak. And it was this one? Yeah, it was that one. Okay. So we're gonna pick up the whole thing. And it is this one. Alright. There. Alright, so that side looks good. Now to do the same thing here with you. Yes, that looks good there. Now the challenge is this intersection. Um. Oh yeah, we found it. Oh, that makes you so happy, folks. Okay, so now we just need to do that horizontal. Did we decide? Um, did we decide on anything for that? <laughs> I don't know if we did. Was it this one we decided on, perhaps? Let's find out. 
and it is Oh, that certainly looks clean there. Yep, I think that'll do it. Alright, so there's the French doors that way. Now we need to do this top section. Boy, he traveled quite a ways out here just to stand. Alright. That looks good. Oh, I'm so happy with that. Now. We need that Get up there. Okay. Hmm. Trying to figure out what block. Wonder. I set it back because this is a window. Oh wait, you know what? I wanted to put a alabaster separation. That would definitely help with this. Alabaster separation. Okay. And we need to do drawn region. No. And I'm setting it. I shouldn't set it back then because it's part of the wall. I'm going to set the window back further than the door, though. Um. Is that big? Go all the way over? One, two, three, four. That leaves twelve up here for the other window. You hear yet? I like. I like that. All right. So let's try. What ones was I using again? I think I was using... Might need to increase my GUI just so I can see these tiny little dots. Um... Do lines again. We'll do one, two, three... Here. No, there doesn't need to be a middle there. Okay, am I gonna be okay with those little lines there just showing a bit of like wood grain? Do do do. I think I'll be okay with that. Let's step back. Remember, we just need to add glass. Hi there, portal.
What do we think of this French door? Quite happy with it. So we're gonna need to put one more up there because I only made it too wide. I should make it three so that it's got the same width on both sides of the glass. So let's do that. <laughs> or even great, huh? <laughs> There we go. So there's three wides. We can put the glass in there that's one pixel wide. Um, we could make it look like screen, but I think they would be glass. Now glass was expensive in the medieval times, but in, in the Americas, in the antebellum south, the big houses had a lot of glass. So let's go check on our Glass. Oh, let's get rid of some of the stuff in here that's taking up space. Our assembly hit no. Yeah, we'll be fine with that. Be able to take it right back out again. It's just in our backpack. Okay, so glass types. Glass types. Let's find out for glass. Um, the shale rimmed. The problem with that is there'll be a line right through the middle. We might have to do streaks to prevent that. And we can do the drawn uh, region or. The pain won't fit in there. We have to do drum region. Okay, so if we do here to there. This one. Is that really only too wide? I thought I made it three just now. Did I only make it two? Well. We need to fix it. Now it's three wide. <laughs> and so we'll be able to do that. Do. Uh, uh, uh. Dang it, I'm doing. Get a bunch of lines. Undo the lock, please. I need to set up my hotkeys. There's our first French door. Beginning to think that the shutters need to have more detail, but the ones that I'm referencing are pretty flat too. And it's not like they're, this is the inside of it that would be closed during the night time. Um, I think I'm pretty happy with that. That looks pretty good in my opinion. So we would just need to copy this another 50 billion times <laughs> around the whole place. 
And so that is what uh, I'm going to need to make a few more patterns, I think, to have the one. Um, oh, let's uh, see here. Oh, to be fair, these are both the same. We could do the bottom side pretty quickly. I'm out of bits, though. Okay, let's make more of those. Wrong chisel, one ring. This one. This. This is what we're working on. Right. Whoops. Okay. Go all the way around the grand entrance. I have to do something special for that. halfway there. Okay, go out. Make some more. So that's a start, and then we need to do um, clean the design, and we're going to do this window, which means we're going to need a lot of different things. This is still this bit. I can't. I do not know if it's the same on this side. Would it be? Sure looks like it. Well, that'll make my life a little easier. Maybe add a glass here pretty soon. I only did one. Um, only chiseled one piece. One block. There we go. We are out of something. So let's do glass. This is three weeks. Let's see if that's it. Nope, it's one of the oak types. So do some dark oak. And we did, I'm trying to remember is fun, we did, um, which one did we do the horizontal in? That one, I think. Is that it? Yes. All right. I may have to correct this. Doesn't look like there's any entrance on this side. Not that there needs to be, but I might have to make like a little door of some sort. Maybe with uh, Ender IO teleporters or something just to get out on that side. Okay, so that is done. This block here. Here is what again? This little bit, the nailed panel. Let's 
see here. Starbuck boy, thank you for the follow and the host. I appreciate it so much. Do, do, do. Okay, what do we have in here? We have... <laughs> Trying to figure out which one it is that I've got to chisel. Let's, um... Oh no! Let's change the uh, GUI scale, not the... Wow, that looks really big after using normal for so long, but this should help me see... Yeah, I can see the detail in these blocks a bit better. Um, we were using this for horizontal and probably this for the... Uh, for vertical and horizontal. So let's see... There is the vertical... Uh, blinds was probably the horizontal. Okay. So now let's copy that top section, which is probably going to be the same on both sides. Space. Looks good. around and whoop. Um, hmm. What did we run out of, you think? Get those used up. Lines. Um, ones that are horizontal. That one? Yeah. Use that. <laughs> Something's going on with him. Poor Silver Fox. Don't need all of those. Do two of the glass. Oh, Rip Wolf. You want me to sleep? I can sleep. Okay, he just randomly went up in flames. A flame bow skelly? Uh, work things, worky things. Do those worky things! I never take my take animals caving with me. Oh. Yeah, then that's... <laughs> uh, okay, and then how thick did we do this? I think we did four. And of course I can't... One, two, three, four. Yes, so I need to get a bit more alabaster because that takes up a decent chunk. Um. Let's put it down. Get up. Room in my bag. Good. Eat. Oh, 
Okay. Let's uh, clear the pattern. And we're going to do the next chunk. And this one we're not going to be able to just go around because there's they're not the same on both sides. We'll copy that one. And we're going to have to do some altering because I've been doing some changes here and there. Face. That. And place. Go around and do that on all of these. Off we go. Oh, it feels so good to be able to use patterns um, instead of having to do each one of these doors individually. Can you imagine? I sure can. Give me that. Hello! Hello. I should definitely make a magnet. That's something we can do with Batania. And the good news is a Batania magnet does not need mana. Let me grab that piece of alabaster that fell in here. Okay. Last one. Oh. Anyone else as excited as I am to see this done? Alright. Clear the pattern again and copy this one. And now I know I'll need to make some materials. But we should be able to just run around and place. the other side. There we go. We need materials. What do you think we need? wonder what we're low on. I'm gonna guess glass for sure. Um... We've got... Let's do glass. Do one more of the glass. That did it. For that one at least. Now we're out of something else. Looks like alabaster. Let's go in and get some more. Sorry about that, my phone decided to send me a text message. I don't know what for, 150. 
11.15. I don't know what it's for. Everyone I know knows I'm streaming right now. <laughs> okay. Look at that! Oh, I'm so excited! Let's go to the front. And, uh, look, can we hop up there? No. And now. Oh, oh, that's gonna look so nice, especially when I get the grand door done. Oh, yay! Oh, I'm so excited! We definitely need to get a second floor on there. Second floor will have a similar amount of doors. Um, where this is, there'll be more doors. There's probably one more right there on that second floor. Um, again, if you've missed, and I will repeat practically every time we're working on the big house, I am using Oak Alley Plantation as my inspiration. You can find them on the web. Just type in Oak Alley Plantation and you will find pictures. Oak Alley Plantation was used in at least one movie that I'm familiar with, and that would be an interview with a vampire by Anne Rice. It's, a, it's an excellent, I love that, the vampire series books from Anne Rice. So, um, it was the one used in the interview with a vampire. Um, it's got a giant row of oak trees out the back. That I'm looking forward to making some giant oak trees out the back. Um, which I think this might be the back. So that when you're looking at the front, you have this beautiful view of mountains in the background. That would be nice. So the oak trees will come out this way. Um, this way will lead towards the Prisoners with Jobs camp. <laughs> um... This is just going to be where my mine colony is, but in, yeah, in plantation terms, that would be the prisoners of jobs. And then the front, I'm thinking about doing, um, we would have the, the road, the horse track coming in for carriages. There would be some kind of a circular centerpiece so that, um, if you have carriages coming and going, they don't have to, they can move over so they can go around the circle to get around. Since you can't, it's really difficult to do a three point turn with some horses in a carriage. <laughs> so I'm going to do that somewhere here. I'm leaning up, it's going to have well manicured lawns. You know, we'll see. Lots of flowers and yeah, I have plans. I'm hoping I can get all of this done before the server needs a reset for the Simple Life 3. But since I know that's just getting restarted, I have several months of fun. Several months of fun! Okay. What else do I have for chisel? I don't have any more chiseling bits jotted down that I wanted to accomplish today. So let's move on to something else. Uh, let's see. What should I work on? One, let's clean up my inventory by putting my bits away. There we go. So I'm gonna put the bits, 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 bits. That. We'll sleep. And, uh. Well, I need to put that food in the cooking for Blockhead's kitchen. Uh, I think what I'm going to do is take another quick five minute break, run to the bathroom, do all that fun stuff. You know, my coffee's cold, so I need to get something else to drink. I will be right back, and we'll figure out what we're going to do for the rest of the uh, stream. We've got another hour or so to go, so stay tuned. I'll be right back. <laughs> 